So what is robotic process automation? This is important to understand what RPA is before we start building RPA processes and automating tasks with an RPA tool such as Microsoft Power Automate Flow slash Desktop. So it is important that RPA simulates any action that an employee or anybody that is trying to automate a task does. It can change a password, it can send an email, it can check an Excel, Excel file, it can do all of those activities that a human does. It is also important to understand that RPA doesn't change any of your underlying systems. So if you have an application or a web page or an Excel sheet, RPA just sits on top of it and spies the different elements. You, you don't have to change anything inside of the code of any of these components for RPA to work. It is a very lightweight application or it is a very lightweight software that is very easy to set up and very easy to get started with, exactly for this reason. It is also important to know that RPA is a software. And that said, it means that there is over 200 RPA vendors and solutions in the marketplace. Microsoft Power Automate Flow and Desktop, that is just one of these 200 solutions. There is solutions for all kinds of budgets and all kinds of uh, requirements that you need to do with RPA. Therefore, there is really it is a very it has been already a democratized technology and many people have access to it therefore you shouldn't stop wasting time and you should start learning it immediately and great that you have picked up this course and decided to understand how to automate with microsoft power automate and desktop now that we have understood what rpa is let's put microsoft power automate into context now there is something that is called uh, a gartner magic quadrant and Gartner is a technology company that does research on different software vendors. And they have placed all of the, well, the majority of the leading RPA vendors inside of a magic quadrant uh, to show which ones, in their opinion, are the ones that are leaders, which ones are niche players, challengers, and visionaries. Microsoft, we can see it, that is right here with the leaders. And the leader is UiPath and Automation Anywhere. This magic quadrant changes pretty much uh, every year and the competition changes and companies change as well. Microsoft wasn't, wasn't present on this list. Uh, it was present, I, I believe, only in 2020 and 2021 since they acquired Microsoft Power Automate Desktop, which previously was a different technology. Now, with this, uh, with this in mind, it is important for you to understand that there is other RPA solutions out there in the marketplace if you should decide to learn to learn them. Now that's all great. Understanding the context of all of these applications and understanding that all of these applications are there, that is great. But what can we do with RPA technologies practically? What can we do? How can it help us automate time and save time? So Microsoft Power Automate can help us with different things. It can help us automate business applications such as Dynamics 365, common data services, applications such as Salesforce or uh, Workday, other applications like that, we can automate anything that we're doing in those applications. We can also automate anything that is regarding our modern workplace, such as mm -hmm. office applications like SharePoint, Microsoft Teams, OneDrive, Power Apps, SharePoint, and so on. The list just continues. We can automate any activity that we're doing on those applications. We can also automate things regarding applications and infrastructure. So, for example, we can automate updating Oracle or managing IoT devices, collecting data from them, storing it, and so on. We can also manage data in AI, like with Power BI and SQL and Excel. We can create reports automatically and on the fly. We can check that certain data pipelines are running and they are and they're, they are operational without us having to log in into the application. We can also do much on social media, such as create posts, do likes, and uh, check different things. Whatever comes to mind, we can pretty much automate it with Power Automate. And in this course, we're going to do so many different little processes and complete processes that we're going to see example in each one of these categories. We're going to cover everything from business applications to social media. My favorites are social media because uh, 
nobody ever really thinks that there is actually a robot behind a certain account but as i will show you in this training it is so easy to create robots that act as uh, that grow different accounts on social media that you will be quite shocked and also you will look at social media maybe from a different aspect or light now with all of that said and done we are ready to pass on to the next chapter and that is intelligent automation